summer in the city Back of my neck getting dirty and bitter I've been down, isn't it a bit? Doesn't seem to be a shadow in the city All around, people looking half dead Walking on the sidewalk, hotter than a match So, uh, Dylan, let's talk about your fucking speed dating adventures What's what's been happening lately? Oh, oh Jesus! Jesus. Also, right. hey, what's up? I'm back. <laughs> oh yeah, we got we got we got my bad. My bad. Chris just did a weird change just over the break. We just uh, switched them out. Well, yeah. And George Bush Props. hasn't changed his. Don't even no, bring it up. He still doesn't care about black people. Okay. Uh, my mic just picked that up. That was it. Thank you. Okay. So I was uh. This is gonna be a, it's gonna be a win for comedy. I'm gonna tell you that right now. Finally, I had to really, uh, I had to really go in on this chick. So I'll read you the conversation. <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> <Yeah>. Hey, <Ayo. laughs> <laughs> high five through the window. <laughs> now bear with me. It'll probably take three minutes to get through it. So chime in whenever you feel the need, and we'll talk about it after. All okay. right, let's do it. Sprinkless. So all she has in her profile. That was the creepiest wave. Did you see that wave? Okay, <laughs> all I have for her profile, besides pictures, is will trade sheep for rock. All right. Okay, so this is what Wait, I want. This is this is you, right? No, that, that's her profile. That's her, that's her description. We'll trade sheep for rock. We'll trade sheep for I rock. I have a feeling okay. she's really into so, astrology. So I said, okay. I got all your rock needs. Limestone, granite, chalk, all the good stuff. She says, you clearly have no idea what Catan is. I said, zero clue. But it makes sense. I've never played it. More of a ticket to ride guy or Monopoly deal. Okay. Now I feel like a moron. To be a moron. Yeah. To be moronical. Ha, 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 she says. But you tried, so you get credit. I said, I'll take it. I need all the credit I can get. Wait, hold up, hold up. Boons. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a not, not a bad start. Boons. So you're going to teach me this crazy game that consists of completely one-sided deals? She says... All right, cut it. I can't do it. Okay. <laughs> it's too long, too. She said, Catan is a game of skill, strategy, and intelligence. Are you up for the challenge? Mm. Oh, I think I played this shit before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like all the settlers and stuff, and you gotta. Yeah. yeah. Last time I, I played it once. Kind of like Risk, right? I've yeah, yeah kind of. I played it once, and I just made a big circle of my own. It's like this is my sheep. Don't fucking touch it. Ah, scheiße. See, so you know that you get the sheep reference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't. I, I didn't at I first. Still don't. I didn't at first. I thought she was some astrology bitch, just like, hey, yo, what? I'm a Leo. So I said, um, listen, and then I answered her, her name. I'm a nice guy, but I will decimate you in this game. I will not settle in Catan. Your body may be one thing, but your feeble not mind is not fit enough to compete with me on any level. Unless we're talking about rocks. I'm clearly retarded when it comes to that. Bars. So, so am I up Bars. for the challenge? <laughs> am I up for the challenge? Yeah, I'd say so. She didn't reply. And then I said, that's what I thought. She said, laugh my ass off. You dropped the dirty R word so you don't get a response. It's 2020. Get with the times. You in full retard, man. The dirty R word? That's what she said. And she responded to you. Yeah, she responded to me. And saying you don't get a response. Yep. So. Hmm. <laughs> yep. That, that's what I'm dealing with on these dating sites. Is it okay for women to say, oh, you're five feet on dating sites? You should be dead. That's okay. And then. You should try Grinder. I think you're a Grinder guy. You should try real world and just talk to people. <laughs> I'll try. It yeah. works. She go to a bar. It works. Go to, yeah. <laughs> so I say, good the R there. word, she says, exclamation mark. If you must know, I'm ahead of my time there, yoga pants. She said. <laughs> <laughs> she said, "Sure." Calm you. down, dog. Word, <laughs> down, word, dog. <laughs> she says, "Sure, you are." I said, "I promise. Very soon, you'll be teaching me yoga poses, and I will teach you how to deadlift more efficiently." Because her picture of her deadlifting looks fucking horrendous. Oh no. She said, "Ha ha ha! I know how to deadlift more efficiently than you. Thank you." Oh. I said, "That's debatable." No, you can't. You're a girl. <laughs> <laughs> I said. <laughs> Dropping the G word like that. The dirty G word. <laughs> the, the dirty, dirty G, G word. So I say... You can't that's, say that. I'm a... Zer. That's debatable. Look, you're clearly into me. We should stop beating around the bush. She said, lol, seriously? Question mark? 
using the R word is a big no no. Ooh. And I was like, so now I'm no like she's serious. I thought she was kidding before. I said, yeah, and I said it to describe myself. Who is that hurting? I fucking do stand up comedy. I've said much worse. And then I said, you can't be for real. She said, I sure am. If you were doing a bit, it would be different. So I say, let me get this straight. The world is literally on fire right now, and you're upset that I texted the word okay, retarded. Okay, calm down. I just texted the word retarded in regards to my own intelligence. I just want to make sure I'm fully understanding this. They, but then that, that knee-jerk reaction is, oh, you said that word, let's look it up on the chart. Oh, that means this and it means that, and now you have to go on TV. Because on the chart, it means you meant that when you said it. It's, but when, you, but when you did that bit, it was really criticizing yourself. She said upset, question mark. If I was upset, it would mean I actually care about this conversation. You're right, though. The world is on fire, and I don't want to ra waste my time responding to someone who uses the word so nonchalantly. Yet I'm here responding anyway again. Okay, if she's... She says she's not upset because she doesn't care about the conversation. Mm -hmm. But let me see something real quick. Yeah, there's, like, messages and messages sent, and yeah. Right? Yeah, so then she obviously cares. So she said, yet I'm here responding anyway. I said, this is amazing. What, are, what other words can't I say? Please enlighten me. If I have a swear, if I say a swear word on this thing, will you have a full-blown panic attack? <laughs> she says, <laughs> she says, full-blown. Yeah, I'll freak out, cry, make a scene. And then I say, but yet when I said the word moron earlier, you replied with ha ha ha. It's okay, you still get credit. So you get to tell me what I can and can't say while you laugh at synonyms for that very word being retarded because I said more on it. Yeah. She laughed at it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I say, do you, do you see the problem with this? She says, yes, I see it. Wild stuff. Thing about when it's individual words, like a lot of people will get busted just for using a word and the context goes away and the irony right. goes away and all that sort of stuff. Real quick sidebar, I feel like this is the same conversation, damn near the same conversation that happens between Brandon and I every time I don't take on a player he doesn't want anymore. Here we go. Seriously. And then we'll start we'll start bickering about it or whatever, and every response is LOL, LMAO. It's like, see, I'm, yeah, I'm not that. insecure because you can see I'm laughing. In I the know, I hate that shit. <laughs> she, she did that a lot until this point, and then Sorry, she Brandon, stopped I laughing. Had to. <laughs> and then I said, it's all about context. And I say your name again. Hate speech is the context rather than the word itself. You aren't speech. helping by not saying a certain word but laughing at another. PC policing must be exhausting. So now I'm not going to waste my time on someone who avoids words and subjects so nonchalantly. Mic drop. She said, you're right. It is all about context. And there was no context warranting the use of the word retarded. That is tip That word is typically accepted as offensive in today's age. The word itself has been deemed offensive by society. And those who have Down syndrome or have someone in their life with what? Down syndrome. Okay, hold on, yeah, hold on, no, no, hold on. Let hold me finish. Let Why me finish. is Down syndrome the first thing she goes yeah, to? Yeah, let me finish. So, and those who have Down syndrome or someone with Down syndrome in their life don't appreciate it being used like this. Don't get me wrong. I love jokes. I've been to a few comedy shows this year already. Real quick, but, who is the person nope, with Down? Let me finish. <laughs> but, to use, but to use the word... Shut, shut the fuck up, Mark! <laughs> But to use let me talk about retards real quick. <laughs> <laughs> let me let me spit that retard shit. Um, but <laughs> but to use the word on Tinder so nonchalantly shows a level of immaturity, and therefore I don't care to answer. But you push for one, so here we are. If there's a group of people that have expressed how offensive the word is to them, why use it in a casual conversation? It's not that hard to avoid it. And then. Said something else. This shit doesn't happen on Bumble, I'm just saying. And I said, oh yeah, I wanted to send her a picture <laughs> of the word retarded, because there's two definitions. And then I say, Google the definition of retarded. Let me do that right now. Well, retardation is what it was called at first, wasn't really, it? Are we really doing this? Oh, yeah, Isn't that, doing no, this. I'm just saying, I'm just yeah. saying. No, dude. Oh, so why does she just go straight to Down syndrome? No, I, that's what I'm going to get at once. Okay, okay. I'm okay. Googling the word retarded. Also, I tried looking it up, and retard is not in the Bible, so it's not really that. Okay, so here it's we not go. A porn category, Liam. You fucking weirdo. What's wrong with you? <laughs> it is a porn category. So here's oh. Netflix. Or <laughs> so I googled the definition. Stop. Pornhub R. Informal definition says, very foolish or stupid. Oh. I think I used it pretty correctly. Yeah, but okay, one second. Uh, to in, in regards what, to what myself. does it say right there? Yeah, there's another there's another definition that says less advanced mental, physical, or social development that is judged at one's age. Kay. Yeah, but what does it say? 
offensive. Is that what you're getting at? Yeah. Yeah, but fucking... How is it? How is... It's Google. Don't listen to Google. Anyway. So I wanted to send her the picture of the definition of retarded. I told her to look at the informal definition. I understand what you're saying. However, I'm not the one who associates that word with Down syndrome. An extra chromosome is vastly different than saying something is stupid or foolish, which is exactly what I did with your stupid Catan reference. You can't laugh at jokes, but then when it comes to something that offends you personally, all of a sudden get offended. Also, you can't see one single word and pretend you know how I meant it when it was said. I've never in my life thought retarded meant Down syndrome. If anything, I would associate it with happy or loving as the Downsies are (laughs) incredible. (laughs) Are incredibly it's my favorite toilet. Are pressure. incredibly passionate people, <laughs> compassionate people. What down needs a toilet paper? Calm it down. Is. Maybe you misunderstood it when I when you read it because it's hard to capture context and text. She says, "Sure, let's chalk it up to a misunderstanding." I said, "Here you go." I said, "Here we go," and she said, "Ha ha ha! You seem like a cocky CrossFit coach who thinks he's funny." But I'm willing. <laughs> He's. She's not wrong though. But she's I'm, not wrong. But I'm willing to start over. Happy Aww. face. And that's the and end of the conversation. Bust her out in an alley back home. Okay. What are your thoughts on that shit? Um, this is what I have to go through on these dating sites. Okay. Shit I, is know, a I know how you should have ended the conversation as soon as she said, uh, "I'm willing to start over." Like, all right. Well, I think the game Catan is fucking retarded. So you want to do something <laughs> else instead? <laughs> no. But. but uh, when you were talking about she made the point that people with Down syndrome don't appreciate being labeled as retarded or however you said it. Yeah. Something like that. Who was the person with Down syndrome that told her that? Also, why is that, like, is that a direct quote? Or she why does that immediately that? go like, to I don't know. Them? Why does it immediately She's go to Down syndrome? She's the one syndrome? who was... Yeah, that's what there's, I'm saying. There's other disabilities. Like She's the one who associates with Down syndrome, not me. Okay. She blamed me for that. No, I'm just saying. No, no, that's what I'm trying to get yeah, at. No, why does she I don't know. automatically go to that? My guess is someone in the family might have it. Like, I don't know. Maybe. Like, I'll say, I'll say. I don't know what that has to do with anything. But, like, there's way more disabilities than just, yeah. like, that's what That's something. why I said when it comes to your neck of the woods, you can't all of a sudden get offended. I can't stand people who everything's funny, then the shit comes around to them, and then all of a sudden they, st- you know, they stop saying it's jokes, they say it's statements. Because it's something you're passionate about, like, that's... Mm-hmm. Well, she uh, can't really get offended because, she, again, she labeled it as just one group of people. Yep. Okay, it's so a couple points this goes back to. First off, we've had conversation and conversation throughout the podcast of how most people, or I guess funny people, deal with shit. Right. Yeah. Deal with, like, tough real-life shit is we find a way to make it funny. And yeah. That, right. That's the whole point of fucking comedy and making people laugh. Is to, uh, that's, it's a coping mechanism. Absolutely. Another Here's, thing. And that's the thing is I, I want to do stand-up, but I don't have enough traumatic experiences to be a comedian. So I don't know, man. <laughs> Your past, you, I think you got some stuff. Taco Bell. Oh, yeah. yeah. A band and necrophilia. You're oh, fucking, yeah, yeah. you're yeah, a front runner. You got some, you got at least one Netflix special in you. <laughs> <laughs> Dave Chappelle. But the other thing is. <laughs> Come okay. Not that I feel the need to fucking qualify myself here, but I'm going to go ahead and qualify myself. For the longest time, I was one of the people that would, that would like, try to correct somebody when they would say retarded. Never go for retard. You don't buy that? Yeah, Sean Penn, 2001, I am saying. Remember? Went for retard. Went home empty-handed. Now, you did that? While. Yeah, yeah, oh, I know, of all fucking things, right? You're the people right? I hate. So... I was like that for a while without even really realizing it because it was the same thing. I was like, come on, man. It's disrespectful. It's rude or whatever. But I didn't well, take into account context. And I just kind of realized that I was I was acting like a an F word. <laughs> and, uh, a fuck. You may, no, you said I'm not allowed to say it. So Yeah, so here I am on the other side <laughs> saying you can't say something. <laughs> so uh, for, one, for one episode. But yeah. I'm sitting there saying like, of all the ignorant shit that I fucking say, who am I to correct people on this? And especially, you got to take into record context. So well, yeah, what was my context again? Saying that I'm a retard and don't know anything about Catan. That's all I said. Well, John Mulaney made a really good joke about that. Yeah. It's just basically saying like, you know, he was writing a TV special and he made a joke about midgets, and then basically was the producer came in and was like, "Whoa, you can't say midgets," and it's like, "Why can't I? It's a perfectly good word to say." Like yeah, and he's like, "Well, that's like saying the N word." It's just like, well, no, it's completely different. First mm-hmm. off, you're saying midget, mm-hmm. and you're saying the N-word. Right. Yeah, if one of us drops an M-bomb during this podcast, That's when everybody's like, oh, okay. uncomfortable. Yeah, of yeah, course. Yeah.